Tonight, there are new policies in place now to heighten security at the Rath building in downtown Buffalo. The big parking garage underneath that building has now been shut down, at least for now. We get more on the story from 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore. It's making things more difficult than it already is down here. Iris Griffin works in downtown Buffalo. She is concerned about the permanent closure of the parking garage under the raft building on Franklin Street. Use it for what it's built for. Stop wasting money. But shutting down the ramp is part of a series of new security measures going into place at the headquarters for Erie County government. This is the seat of Erie County government. If uh, some sort of security mishap was to happen in that tunnel underneath this building, it could effectively decapitate county government. Erie County Press Secretary Peter Anderson says the county is being proactive after a report from the Department of Homeland Security called the ramp a security risk. Security is always a top issue for the administration, keeping employees and the public safe. County leaders have even added more patrol officers at all doors. They're also checking IDs at the entrance of the pedestrian bridge on Pearl Street. And if you're planning to go anytime soon, you will only be able to enter on Franklin Street. From yeah. Pearl Street, the uh, doors on that side which had been for entrance and exit are now specifically just for exit. Anderson says more measures could go into place soon but Iris questions why the county won't just keep the parking garage open and add security. I think it should be used for what they built it for. We can't let um, the terrorists scare us off from doing what we do. You know they can't we can't stop them from let us, letting us live. Now, Anderson tells me there is resolution in front of Erie County lawmakers for more security officers and to even buy devices to check for bombs. In the studio, Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News. All right.